Hello my friends from YouTube, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, replace the motherboard on this uh, phone. It's called a uh, UMX. Um, this phone is working fine, but um, I just uh, want to show you how to replace the motherboard. Uh, so um, for this we're going we're gonna to use uh, this bracelet, it's called anti-static. anti-static bracelet okay um, we're gonna use some um, twizzlers and a set of screwdrivers mini screwdriver okay everything you do is in your own risk I am not responsible for any damage that you cause to your device this uh, video is for education purpose only thank you okay um, I don't want to make my video super long so um, sometimes I'm gonna post my video. Okay. Um, before you uh, uh, tear down an, an electronic device, make sure it's turned it off, and um, maybe make a backup or your picture, documents, whatever you have, because uh, if something happened, it might not turn on anymore. And uh, so it's a good idea also to backup sometimes. Okay. So. Uh, we're gonna go here around and right here by the charging port there is a, like a space here for the nail then just go like that okay so that's the that's the back cover put it over there then remove the to remove the battery just insert your nail here like that and this is uh, the model, okay? UMX and it's U663CL, okay? That's the model, okay? Now we're gonna remove all the, the, the screws. Also, I use a magnified glass. I use this magnified glass, it's really good. You can buy it in any computer store or you can buy it at ebay or online okay so don't forget to remove the sim this is a sim card okay so don't forget to remove it put it on the side don't make sure you don't lose it and uh, we're gonna remove all these screws so it's we're gonna start from here okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen uh, 16 wait just a minute okay yes uh, 16 screws okay okay so I'm gonna start from here and I have a magnet magnetic here so I can go like that Okay, I am removing the last screw here. And the good thing about these screws is that they are the same, all the six things are the same size. Okay. Also, we can now use this open, the opening tool, just go like right here. Sorry. Oh, with your nail right here. See, I use my nail a lot because my nail 
as Arabella is strong and very mm, flat so so right here you see okay so I remove this this part put on the side remember where you put all the your parts okay so this is the motherboard okay this is the motherboard and um and we have to disconnect we need to disconnect four five cables okay but I'm not gonna disconnect this one because this is a solder. It's a solder right here. It's it's solder from from a, from a part from here is solder to here. So I'm not gonna play with this because this phone is working. But I, at least I show you how to do it, right? So let's connect this one. This one. Be careful with this one because it's so tiny. This is like antenna. Okay, right there, and then this is a tiny one right here. So with this one, I'm gonna use a a small a flat. This is not flat. I have one here, a flat screwdriver. Right there. Make sure you go like that. See, and then pull this cable, and we have to remove one, two, two screwdrivers right here. So this one. I hope you can see it. Be careful when you remove these little ones because sometimes they, they, it jumps and then you don't see them again. So remove the other one here, put it in this side of the magnetic if you have one. No, oh, one more, to right here. You see right here? That's why it's not moving. So it's three, four screwdrivers, four. Okay. It jumps, but I, I got it here. So, right here is the other one, so it's four, okay? Four to remove the motherboard. If you need to to, to de desolder this, then you need to do it before you remove the screws. You need to desolder this and move it to the side, and then when you put the new motherboard, then just make sure you um, you connect the lines here where it goes and put a little solder and make sure this doesn't touch the next one okay now with this flat screwdriver i go like this i like uh, pull it up and you see there is the motherboard okay it has a camera key camera camera here this is the front camera that goes here okay so let's say we connect the new motherboard you just place it like the way it is like that this is the volume buttons be careful okay so now make sure the the cables are on top okay And like I said, remember this, you, you need to replace it for a new motherboard, you need to desolder this cable, and then solder it back, okay? Make sure the motherboard goes, like a connect, connect to the plastic holder, and then you can, you can, uh, 
que tiene screw back, ok. So now let the screw back. So remember we have uh, these four, the little ones, and I screw it back. Right. Okay, don't over tie the screw, just go when 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 it stops, just twist it a little bit more and that's it. Don't over tie it because you can break something. Okay, so I put the four screws and I connect this one. Be careful to when you connect these cables because if you damage one uh one of the tiny connections then it might not work and remember the little ones so you go like this make sure it goes straight okay you see so now that that is already all the way down, just lock it up with the, the, the clip. Okay, see? You see? I don't know if you can see the white line here, but it's all the way, all the way connected. Okay. Okay, so now let's connect the antenna here. Let's make sure it goes, goes right here, so it's not coming out. Careful when you disconnect one, this one because I remember a long time ago when I disconnected I pull it out with the connection that it was attached was sorted to the motherboard and then I couldn't put it back so I have to replace the motherboard. So be careful when you disconnect this little cable. Okay, so now as you see this is um it's connected, make sure all the cables are fine. Okay, so now let's put it back there. Or oh, remember the, don't forget about the, the, the volume, the buttons, okay. So this one goes right here. This little cable should be like this. Okay. And now let's put this back. So make sure you lock it up, lock it up here, and then go like that. The buttons look good. Looks good. Click it to see if. It's working yes so now i'm gonna put the screws back okay uh, i'm gonna pause my video so it won't be super long okay okay i'm gonna start from this don't over tie just when it stop you twist it a little bit and that's it then i'm gonna Screw this one and uh, one more. Okay, okay, so I'm gonna um, screw the last screw. That's right here. <laughs> They are so tiny that when it's dark, you don't see it. Uh, also, I use a lot of light because it's so difficult to work without light. So I use um, screw the last screw. So now let's put the battery. So when you insert the battery, just make sure make sure the 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 three gold connections match the three gold connections that, that is attached to the motherboard okay just like that now 
Let's put the cover back. And now let's see if this is gonna turn on or not. But uh, it was like I said, it was working fine. See, it's working. Uh, so that's the way you replace a um, motherboard on a UMX cell phone. Um, I hope you like my uh, video. Please, este, please subscribe. Give me a like. Check my other videos. I have a lot of videos of uh, different, different re preparing. And um, thank you and have a good day.